I did not think there would be a drop. A, a drop has happened. A drop has occurred. <laughs> Hello everyone, my name is Comedian and it only gets worse from there, really. Um, but uh, enough of that, because today it's time to be back on the RM mono reaction playlist reaction train again. Um, because I'm almost, uh, oh actually slightly over halfway through this, this mixtape at this point. Incredible record speed I'm saying, most reactors did it in one video, but if I did it in one video, uh, it would be about four years long, and I don't really have the patience, the brain power, the manpower, uh, just any of that stuff to be dealing with this. So I'm just going to do it probably track by track. This one is kind of short. Maybe I'll do two songs in this video. Some people have suggested that in my last video. I do, I do uh, Bad Boy and Ugood at the same time. But at the same time, it would be kind of nice to have to be edit a, to edit a video this week that isn't 10 years long so we'll see we'll see i'll see how much stuff i have to say about bad bye with e a on that's a lot of vowels for one word for one name even i mean save some for the rest of us i bet that guy sucks at scrabble <sighs> Anyway, uh, thank you so much for those of you who've been enjoying my uh, mono playlist reaction so far. And that would include me. Thank you, me. I've been having a great time with it. Uh, it's It really was... I don't know what I was expecting from it, but it blew me away. Uh, and like I said in the other video, it just gave me so much more respect for RM as an artist, as a human being, and as somebody I would quite like to have a cuddle with. Um, anyway, so... Yeah. Um, all right. Uh, gross stuff. So subscribe. Ugh, uh, Patreon. Ugh, uh, link in the description. Run BTS. Uh, Discord. Less ugh. You know, let's have a nice time with friends in that place. Okay, that's done. So I think we're good to go. Hooray! Okay, so we have a mosquito buzzing around a corner shop light as an intro. Very, very atmospheric album. I love what he does with sound. This is great. This is great. I want to know how musically how was this album composed? Like, did he? Did he? Was it completely all him? Like, did he have people helping him? Did BTS sneak into the room and have a little, you know, tickle on the the, the tambourine? I don't know music, but I I want to know, you know, how much input he had into this. Like, if he just said the lyrics, and I mean, I know they're all like amazing musicians, so I'm, I'm guessing the answer could well be all of it, but I don't want to believe that, you know? Because that's like, I don't know, it's annoying when people have that much talent. It's infuriating, quite frankly. Ugh. But this sounds like a really atmospheric, cool, vibey intro from one of the bands I would listen to. I'm more of a kind of a EDM kind of person, electronic, but not just like, you know, I like the energetic, the sick wubs, the, the bros there, but I also like the chill wubs, you know, the, the chill vibes. And this kind of sounds like some really like trippy, like psychedelic, like kind of like down tempo EDM I might listen to. Like I like, I love this intro so far. And the musical filters, the vocal filters are really playing to that as well. So I did not think there would be a drop. A, a drop has happened. A drop has occurred. I am in shockness. I am shocking. I shocked in my pants. I'm, a, I'm afraid to say. A, a what? A drop? And a great one. This is sick. And I'm glad the lyrics are more simplistic because I can focus on the words. Wow, that is taking that is taking the phrase "kill me softly" to a, a next level. And I'd argue if if somebody kills you to the extent where you can be scattered in fragments, they didn't kill you softly. You didn't get your money's worth. I'd ask for a refund from whatever hitman you hired to do that because that is not being killed softly. That is being killed very hard. But yeah, wow, uh, these lyrics. They're interesting, but I'm loving the music. And so far, it's hard to kind of really get a grip on what this song is about. I mean, obviously, we've heard the words bad, bad by shouted out quite a lot. And I think a bad, bad by is like RM's play on words on, you know, goodbye, obviously. So it's not even a goodbye, it was a bad by, and it was a bad, bad by. 
Which is funny because when I first made that connection in my brain, I was like, that sounds like the sort of thing that a person who has English as a second language, like, would think is like, this sounds mean, but like, would, would think is like, you know, a really clever play on words. And it almost sounds like, I don't know, like it sounds awkward. But the more I thought about it, the more I like it really. And I, I think I've actually made this point before, but I really like hearing people who aren't native speakers, apostrophe S, take on a language because like there's no such thing as incorrect language, improper language. I hate any pretension around that. The dictionary exists as an, you know, the, the reason the dictionary changes and they didn't just make one edition back in 1450 and then, you know, never update it again and it would still cost two halfpennies. The reason they keep making new editions is because language evolves and the people who make dictionaries know that. So I don't know why, you know, grammar fascists are out there just, you know, complaining about language changing. Point being, I think it's very interesting when somebody who doesn't have English as, an, as, a, as a first language or, you know, whatever scenario it may be, but English is the one I know about, says, says this phrase and it's kind of influenced by their, their own like mother tongue because it's, I don't know, it's just very interesting. I'm like, how is this happening? How is, oh my goodness. Great. Well, that is an alarm to me to take Prozac and that's not going to happen for a while. So yeah, sorry, brain, deal without those neurotransmitters for a hot second. You know what? I think this probably—I probably will make this song a one, a one, a one-song reaction. This video, this eight minutes gone already, and it's just. Anyway, uh, the alarm, the alarm, the alarm. Should, probably should cut this out. Who wants to see this? Answer, no one. Okay. Right. Where was I? But yeah, I just find I think it is interesting with people who are non-native speakers for language. Uh, you know, bring in influences from their own language. Because, you know, the more I think about it, bad, bad buy, or even like just the phrase, oh, it was a bad buy. Like, I love it. It's kind of, it does have a childish quality to it, but I like its simplicity. Like, I definitely, I like it. And yeah, I wonder if this song is about the pain you feel when you have to say goodbye to somebody, but it's like a bad, bad buy, like a bad breakup or something like that. Still looking for more context. But the very dramatic nature of the song would point that way. You and, I. you and I. That is another clue added to the list. Okay, so it might be I might be on the mark with a relationship that ended poorly. Love that heavy 808 kick with the drum. Boom. Said it before I say it again. This album. Premium Korean sad boy music. Was you know why? Was that in? Okay. You know why? It's like, well, I think I know why. I don't think I'm, I'm the you involved, but I think I know why, but maybe a few more lyrics to explain it, RM. Don't leave me hanging. That was really cool. That was a very, very, very atmospheric, like, middle... I'm seeing that thoroughly as, like, the middle bridge, like, the intermission that connects, I'm guessing, two halves of this album. The question now is, dare I dive down into the path of the next song? Because everyone's raved about it. How long is it? it starts at 13, goes to 15. Wait, how long? Oh, so it's about two and a half minutes. So maybe I could risk it? Uh, I just feel like it's weird to do a video that's two songs after doing one song per video. And it's also weird to include you guys in this conversation. I really should have thought this about this before I did this. I'm sorry, guys, it's late. That's my, it's late. You know, like I just, this video is already long enough. Like, uh, you know what? I'm gonna record my reaction to Our Good right now. So it's still like the same vibe, but just not in this video. I can't do it to myself. I think if I have to edit another 30 minute video, I'll probably just, you know, quit YouTube for another year. So yeah. Uh, anyway, uh, hopefully you guys skipped all of that or I edited it out. Uh, who knows of me? I'm crazy. But yeah, like I said, that was a really cool song. I thoroughly see that as like the intermission. I'm about to go and see uh, what our good is like. Our good, our good, our good, our good, our good. Are oh, good? Are uh, you good? I don't know. So, uh, yeah, look out for that reaction. That's coming soon, presumably, uh, you know, as far as technology goes. Uh, chronological. The way my brain doesn't function. 
So yeah, hope you guys enjoy my reaction. I thought that was a really, really cool atmospheric song. Like I really, really liked that. And it surprised me because it was like a kind of soft, trappish, like kind of EDM banger. Like, even the vocals were like that. They were like, heavily processed in a really cool way. Just a very, very moody song. Very, very cool. Like I could easily see me like, cause this is the sort of album where I'm like, I can't really do this on video because as I like, said, the whole, you know, filming a four year video thing and editing it, it just can't be done. But the fact that this, this album like is so just thematically joined and cohesive and stuff and I've liked all the songs off it, I am definitely like determined once I finished filming this to actually listen to it by myself in my own personal me time, comedian time. <laughs> what a great joke that is. I'm losing it. Uh, to actually listen to it as a whole. But for now, I should stop talking because I could have arguably done a reaction to the next song in this time. <laughs> anyway, hope you guys enjoy the reaction. Thank you for coming along. Don't forget what I said earlier about subscribing, Patreon, Discord, all that stuff. You know the deal. Oh, and remember, if you like my reaction to Bad Bye, then click the subscribe button or I will sad cry. Where is my drink? Unbelievable.